everybody and welcome to this edition of Spotlight on the Bensonville Park District. I'm Rick Robbins, the Executive Director at the District, and with me today is our Superintendent of Recreation, Mr. Rory Joyce, and uh, we're going to talk about health, wellness, fitness, all and everything that uh, falls under that. And Rory, thanks for joining me. Um, why don't you give me a kind of an overview of what the Bensonville Park District has to offer in terms of fitness at the Park District? Absolutely. Um, at our headquarters, uh, the Deer Grove Leisure Center, we have a great fitness center. We're at 1000 Westwood Street, right off of Route 83, very conveniently located. We have a great fitness center with room for more people. Uh, we recently just got in um, our new fall programs and fall classes starting as well as you know year round. Um, we have a six day per week um, fitness calendar. Uh, fitness calendar per week. You know we offer classes Monday through Friday mornings and evenings, Saturday mornings, um, and really the, the fitness center is open. You know until 10 p.m. and uh, starting at 5:30 in the morning, and then from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. Saturdays and Sundays. Um, great things going on. Personal training you can do if you're looking for more one-on-one -on -one attention. Uh, brand new walking track is en route and um, that is something that is free to the public and um, we offer open gym, rentals, many things along at the Deer Grove Leisure Center. Uh, additionally, we do the Eggs and Legs, uh, John Kurtz 5K walk run every year. So we really have a lot of things, you know, part of Park Districts and Recreation is fitness, wellness, how you can become healthier, how your family can become healthier, and that's something we try to emphasize. Okay, great. And just to clarify, uh, as part of that uh, in the gymnasium, we do have a walking track that's currently in place. So what we're getting is a new surface on that track. Correct, um, correct. And it'll, it'll appear brand new, it'll have a, a better cushion to it, and uh, it'll be nicer for our users that uh, like to take advantage of that, especially throughout the winter time. Right. Um, Tell us, inside the fitness center then, tell us about uh, what kind of machines and workout routines that uh, are offered and what, you know, what do we have in our fitness center there at Deer Grove Leisure Center? Right, you know, in many years at the district, never received a complaint that you don't have enough machines or anything like that. Additionally, we have uh, five brand new top of the line Precore 880 uh, treadmills. Uh, what these treadmills allow you to do is track your fitness. You, you know, you can log in, you know, just like anything else, log in, you know, say you run two miles Monday, run two miles, you know, Tuesday. It tracks that by the week, by the year, if you like. Additionally, there's also an app you can do. So if you decide to take an outdoor run or other types of fitness, it can continually fact track your fitness, which is so important, you know, you know, when you're thinking about counting calories and how much you exercise and things like that, it's important to, you know, when you, you know you have technology, use it, and that's what that's part of what we brought in with our new treadmills. Um, and that's just the start of our machines. You know, we have four ellipticals, uh, you know, recumbent and stand up bikes. Um, we have a new step, a uh, stairmaster, weight machines of all type. Whatever you know, whether it's triceps, glutes, um, abdomen, you know, thighs, whatever you are looking to exercise. We have different things machines that you can work in, work that into your routine, and obviously plenty of free weights as well, if that's more um, what you're looking for. Um, medicine balls, mats, different things that you can integrate into your workout. And it's really nice because it's, it's how we're located, you know, we got the fitness center right here, the gym right here, you know. Part of every, you know, fitness membership is, you know, you can also play basketball if you want, if that's something that you want to do. And with the walking track right there with the new new surface that you just spoke of, it's really it's really conveniently located. It's like a nice downtown for right. fitness. Right. Yeah. So and all those machines target different areas of the body, you know, whatever areas you feel you need to work out or, you know, obviously breaking it up daily so you're not working out with the same routine each day. Uh, I know some of the folks really love the free weights, but those machines are safe and easy to use for everybody. Correct. Um, I, I know we offer, in addition then to the fitness center, uh, we offer over 25 different fitness classes throughout the week. So what can you tell us about that and, and uh, how we structure that program? Right, you know, these, uh, these 25 or more classes, you know, we break them up different ways so that there's really something for everyone. You know, certain classes are, you know, guaranteed, you know, more for our active adults, you know, Fit Over 50, Chair Yoga, and Zumba Gold are just a few of them. These are designed to give you a good workout, 
but also um, instructors make a point to offer suggestions to modify the exercise if needed. If you're not at the level or everyone in the class is at, they can assist you and help you modify that. Um, and, and it really brings more of a personalization of the class that um, really benefit there. Um, our evening classes, as well as some of the morning and Saturday ones, uh, large variety for ages 14 and up, which you know you have to be 14 years of age to take the majority of our fitness classes. Um, Zumba is a popular class in which we have different varieties. Um, we got you know Zumba, Zumba Gold, which I already mentioned, Zumba Toning, and uh, Zumba Kids. I'll talk about our kids classes in a few minutes. Um, but Zumba's for everyone. You know Latin rhythms that uh, inspire you know cardio dance moves. Um, you know other classes for everyone that. Can, can fit other, you know, everyone is, um, you know, uh, Pio, which is a combination of uh, Pilates and yoga. Uh, Pilates is kind of slow and controlled movements and combined with the posing and the muscle contractions you find in yoga. We have yoga classes as well, which are popular. Um, Another class uh, that can fit to everyone is is X biking. You know, as those winter months come, and you know you're a bike rider and you can't do the bike riding you want to do, uh, we offer X biking class, which is a nice class. We have special X biking that doesn't just work the legs; it works different muscles, um, and and it's ten per class. You know, so we're never you're never too many people in in classes like that um, with our X biking class. Um, we have a special room, the X bike room, specifically devoted to that. You know. Further down the line, you know, if cardio is what you're into, we have Cardio Blast. Um, it means what it sounds like, but it's, but it's not overly intense, but appropriate for all fitness levels. I mentioned the personalization. We do have also, you know, if you're in that very active, high level, you know, exercise, you know, we do offer uh, HIT, which is high intensity interval training, as well as boot camp. Um, you know, the hit classes are, you know, high, you know, cardio training, intensity bursts, follow, followed by uh, breaks of rest. Uh, it's a really good calorie burner. Uh, and boot camp, which I also mentioned, is good for people looking for a challenge. Um, so what what I'm hearing is we've really got classes for all levels. Right. Um, whether you're just starting your workout routine or just starting to think about getting fit, getting back into shape, whatever it might be. Mm -hmm. We've got classes that will suit your needs, but if you're really wanting some high intensity training, we can accommodate you there as well. Right, all ages and sizes and, and different fitness levels, we welcome. Our classes are very affordable and um, it's really, it's really right. great. And challenge. I know we've got some aquatic classes in the summertime that are offered at our at Absolutely. our water park and such, but you've talked a lot about the fitness classes for adults. How about the fitness classes for the kids? What do right. we do? What do we do to try to get our kids in shape? Because quite frankly, um, childhood obesity in our country is an absolute critical mm -hmm. issue to right. address. Yeah, it's 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 a very critical issue, and and in our community um, as well. We'll talk a little bit more about you know some of the big drives we're making toward nutrition, but we do offer things that are good for kids. You know, I mentioned all our Zumba classes. We do have Zumba like our adult classes are all ages 14 and up, but we do have kids Zumba for um, you know kids six to 13. A new class that we have um, that we've just introduced now is uh, Peak Performance, and it helps you improve your athletic performance and works on your speed and agility okay. you know and that that's a new class that we have just taking off now you know we also offer things for even even younger than six you know peewee gym and things like that and you know we're primarily talking about you know fitness today but um we do you know offer so many youth athletic programs and such you know not every kid is necessarily going to want to sign up for kid zumba or an exercise class, but we try to bring that out in our football, soccer, volleyball, so many of the different athletic programs we have. But fitness is a great thing because, you know, you can't play every sport every day, but it's important to stay active every day. Um, now, sure, we want the kids, we want the kids to be active, we want the, the families to be active, and that's, that's one of our goals. Yeah, get the kids outdoors, get them participating in programs. Look, I, I've, I'm a big proponent of you can do everything that we provide you really on your own, and mm -hmm. and I'm a and I'm a staunch proponent of of self 
recreating, yes. so to speak. But if you need us to program it, you need us to provide that league or that outlet, we are there for the community. Right. In addition to, you know, the classes for kids 14 and up, you know, we do require a waiver signed by a parent or guardian for a minor, but um, you can also get a fitness center membership ages 4 to 17 with a similar waiver. We do have a different weights policy uh, for, you know, ages 14 and 15. We don't like people getting into the free weights at too young of an age, and right. we closely monitor that. and. And, and we'll help you. You know, I, I know sometimes when you new fitness center or maybe you're a young young kid, you know, just getting into fitness um, in a fitness center type environment, you know, we can help you look at the machines, find out what's right for you, find right. out what's right for you. Well, and I know for uh, the kids, especially the uh, middle school kids after school, we offer open gym there at the Deer Grove Leisure, Leisure Center. They can even buy a monthly pass. It's it's so minimal that they could come in and play basketball most days after school yes. and, and hang out and be active and be in a safe, supervised environment. Absolutely. Safe. We offer it uh, just about every weekday. And if you look at buying the monthly pass, you know, it's and, and you come and play basketball every day, it, it's it's really pennies a day yeah. for, for what they can do and, 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 and stay active. That's great. Recently, we've been uh, really making the effort to take uh, our fitness and our wellness to another level with uh, nutrition, uh, healthy eating, um, some other lessons that we're trying to teach our pre you know, all the way from our preschoolers through our BPD club kids. And, uh, you know, tell us about a little exciting things yeah. that we've had going on this year with that. You know, we talk about fitness, but, you know, nutritious and wellness, it's, it's all intertwined there. And um, we were quite fortunate this year. Um, we applied for and received a, um, a grant through the National Recreation and Parks Association combined with Walmart to help us promote not just fitness, but nutrition and wellness. And what that is maybe um, that kind of combines and, and, and we'll talk a little bit more um, you know, about that in, in, you know, in the next segment. But what we have done is we have integrated our, one of our personal trainers is also a dietitian and nutritionist. And what we do is we scheduled her to present to our camps and our BPD club nutrition segments and things like that, that is at no further cost to, uh, you know, to our campers. And you know, just great things that you want your kids to learn about healthy eating, how to eat, you know, how to eat better and stuff like that. And it helps when you have a person with, with Luman's level of knowledge that um, really gets across to those kids, and there, you know, there's a bunch of things um, that they have um, that they have done there. That's great. I know we're also working very closely with the Northern Illinois Food Bank in yes. providing nutritious meals to all of our summer camp kids, right? To our before and after school care kids, and that's been a great partnership that's helped out as well. They complement each other very well. Yes. All right. We're going to take a little break, and we'll be back uh, to talk more about uh, some of the stuff that uh, we're, we've been able to do with the grant that we've received and uh, share some more about the health, wellness, and fitness that the Bensonville Park District is providing to each of you. Aquatic Center is conveniently located in the Redmond Recreational Complex in Bensonville. The Water's Edge is home of Fenton High School and Wahoo swim teams, featuring an indoor eight lane lap pool and diving well. The Aquatic Center is available for private functions and parties. Learn to swim, stay in shape, or enjoy recreational swimming year-round at the Water's Edge Aquatic Center. 
The Bensonville Community Library, serving a community of readers. Whether you're old or young, a lover of words, music, or computers, the library has something for you. Check out our new Kindles, toddler jams, story and movie nights, or a variety of other activities offered. For more information, call us at 630-766-4642 or check out our schedule on the web at benlib.org. The Bensonville Community Library, celebrating 50 years of library service. Staying connected is important, and at the Village of Bensonville, it has never been easier to keep up to date with what's happening in our community. On your phone, PDA, PC, laptop, or tablet, the Village of Bensonville website offers easy integration, so you'll stay connected at home, in the office, or on the road. To follow us on Facebook, simply go to the Bensonville homepage and click on the Facebook icon in the lower left-hand corner. This will take you to the Bensonville Facebook fan page. Once there, click the like button to add us to your newsfeed and receive regular updates from around town. To follow us on Twitter, simply go to the Bensonville homepage and click on the Twitter icon in the lower left-hand corner. This will take you to the Bensonville Twitter page. Once there, click the follow button to add us to your Twitter feed and receive regular community updates. To receive email and cell phone notifications, click on the Notify Me button. This will take you to the Notify Me dashboard. Once there, simply add your email address and or cell phone number at the top of the page and then select which service you would like to receive updates from. The most common update section is in the News Flash Bensonville News. Click on the envelope icon for email alerts and on the phone icon for phone alerts. You can choose one, the other, or both. To watch our public access cable show or board meetings, simply click on the Bensonville Web TV button on the lower left sidebar menu of the homepage. This will take you to our streaming center where you can play current and past Bensonville cable TV shows and board meetings. To pay your Bensonville utility bill online, just click the online payments button and then follow the instructions provided on our secure payment site. If you have any problem, concern, or question to tell the village, then click on the Bensonville Action Hotline button. This will take you to the Action Line dashboard, where you can explain your issue and receive a response within 48 hours once you have clicked the Submit button at the bottom of the page. Staying connected is important. And at the Village of Bensonville, it has never been easier to keep up to date with what's happening in our community. On your phone, PDA, PC, laptop, or tablet, the Village of Bensonville website offers easy integration, so you'll stay connected wherever you are. back here with the spotlight on Bensonville Park District. I'm Rick Robbins, the director of the district. And uh, from uh, what I understand, I'm here with Rory Joyce, our superintendent of recreation, as I'd mentioned before. And uh, Rory, it is an exciting time for health, wellness, fitness at the Bensonville Park District. Um, you mentioned that we received a grant. I know that was for $35,000 from Walmart and NRPA, which is a, a really a big deal. That's not just a little grant. And tell us a little more about what we've uh, been able to achieve with that grant here at the Park District. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it has allowed us to work nutrition and fitness into our the regimen of things that we already have going, like our summer camps and BPD club. Um, we do the nutritional and health demonstrations uh, to those groups. Um, you know, on a weekly basis, integrated with our um, our food program, and um, additionally, it's it's gotten us to 
try some new things, do some new things. We have our, our community-wide family wellness fair coming up here October 13th um, from 3 to 7 p.m. It is a um, going to be a great event. We have new gardens housed outside the Leisure Center. Um, one big thing is we are looking to uh, install a new um, water park physical activity structure. Um, you know, more more things that are going to help our kids play more. You know, new tennis kits, ultimate frisbee, track, archery, assorted sports, what have you. We do uh, yoga and Zumba classes for those same camps. We do, um, you know, which can, you know, another value add for our camps and uh, BPD club. And I mentioned the, uh, the peak performance speed and agility class. That's also kind of um, getting going uh, through the grant. So in addition to a lot of new equipment that we've been able to attain here at the Park District in order to introduce more sports, more variety to a lot of our other programs or even add new programs itself, we've been able to incorporate right into existing programs like the camps and BBD Club as you mentioned the uh, health, nutrition, wellness aspect. Right. So we have been able to bring in speakers, we've been able to bring in trainers, instructors into our camp program that we otherwise would not have been able to afford to incorporate Correct. into those programs. And so it has been, as you mentioned, a real value add to our camps. Uh, I, I really would put our camps up against anybody's in the entire region in terms of value of what the kids are getting for their dollar mm -hmm. um, all summer long in our summer camps. So if you missed it this year, I urge you to uh, look at getting your kids involved in that next year. But it, beyond the summer camp then, we've got our before and after school club, our BPD club, mm -hmm. and those kids are getting to experience some of those same benefits, correct? Absolutely, absolutely. Those, uh, you know, the Zumba and yoga classes, that's gonna happen. And those same type of nutritional demonstrations, you know, just how, you know, summer camp ended one day and then the very next day we went into BPD club. It's the same thing with our, our health and nutrition. We're going to, you know, plow, continue that year right. round throughout the So no longer are those kids just coming to our rec center after school, nice. sitting there, maybe getting on a computer, maybe getting on whatever electronic device, maybe just... Uh, vegging out per se maybe for a couple hours but we're actually getting them active we're get, we're working on getting them healthy we're providing a healthy meal that the northern only food bank is providing to us mm -hmm. we're getting them outside they're working on the garden i know they just were harvesting some of the garden uh, vegetables that the kids earlier in the summer had planted right it's and uh, you know those kind of things were really bringing some of that wholesome goodness back to our a lot of our programs absolutely just like you know when, when families, when parents are at work and they entrust us to oversee their kids, that's what this grant is, this out of school time grant, to make this out of school time, whether it's during the summer when the kids are off. Quality time. Exactly, or after school, give it, make it good time. Not just vegging or watching YouTube or you know, eating Cheetos. We are having you know, nutritious meals provided for them as well as fun active things if, if they're not playing in the gym or getting a getting a nutritional or fitness demonstration you know they're working on homework we're, we're keeping these these yeah. kids productive during this time great that's awesome you mentioned uh, the new family wellness fair and I know yes. we're really excited about that it's a big deal for the community as a whole uh, we hope all the other agencies and all the corporations and businesses in town will all come out and be a part of this event um, this is all made possible because of the grant as well. So tell me a little more about the, the fair that's coming. Absolutely, and you know, at the Park District, we love having, you know, big events year round, and this is just another one that we're adding, you know, in part funded wise through this grant. Um, we have uh, two things going on. We have our fall fitness sale, which is September through October 15th, which on the end of that is our October 13th, um, you know, family wellness fair, uh, 3 to 7 p.m. On that day, you know, free use of the fitness center, free use, you know, you can take classes for free that evening. Um, we have so many things going on. Um, we are doing a blood drive. Um, you, can, you can register on our website or at lifesourceblooddonation.org. Um, 
we will be doing, we'll have some healthy snacks, but more importantly, we're gonna be having uh, nutritional and cooking demonstrations with our registered dietitian and nutritionist. Uh, we'll feature programs from the park district, um, you know, including the School of Dance and Movement, Peak Performance, Kids Karate, all park district programs that we have to offer. Uh, in addition to the park district, we will um, have the village of Bensonville there, NEDSRA with the Healthy Minds, Healthy Bodies program, which um, helps veterans. Uh, ATI Physical Therapy will do some injury screenings and offer you know advice on kids' athletic injury information like concussions. Walgreens will be there to offer flu shot options, blood pressure checks, and more information. Um, We'll have a cancer center on hand bringing information and doing screenings. Numerous other wellness information, you know, throughout the evening, um, not to mention your giveaways and raffles and things like that. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty excited about that and uh, can't wait to really see where that, where that goes for us. Um, Rory, thank you very much for joining us and uh, giving us a, a great overview of what we offer here at the Bensonville Park District in terms of family, fitness, wellness, nutrition, and all of those things that uh, are related with that. Uh, again, I'm Rick Robbins, uh, the director here at the Park District, and uh, we thank you for joining us today. We hope we'll, if we didn't see you at the uh, Bensonville Be Well event, we hope you'll join us at the uh, Family Wellness Fair that we're offering in October. So we'll, we'll see you soon.